Hi, hope you're having a fabulous day today. My name is Robin Pitts with Sir Chauncey Rocco Creative Designs. I have two projects that I'm very excited to share with you. Last month, I joined a new group called the Julie Nutting Doll Stamp Collaboration. This is a project hosted by Terry at Terry E01, D at D's Special Things, and Dawn at Dare to Be Creative on YouTube. For this collaboration, each month there will be a new theme and a new prompt word. The theme for February is, of course, Valentine's Day and Hearts, and the prompt word is Envelope. For my projects, I use this paper stack by Recollections. It's called Vintage Valentine's Day. The first project that I'd like to share with you is my Rhinestone and Roses Valentine's Day Loaded Envelope. I had so much fun creating this project. And as you can see, front and center is my Julie Nutting doll, Tasha. I think she looks absolutely stunning. I've paper pieced her dress, and I gave her lots of bling with this really pretty clear crystal, which is also a perfect complement to this envelope. Now I'm not going to spend time reviewing this envelope because I have recorded a separate video going through all of the contents and I will be sure to link that in the description below. But really I just want to draw your attention to how beautiful Tasha has come out. There are four layers of her. I have a base layer under this and actually to make her sturdier I cut her out on watercolor paper and on top of that I included a thick 100 pound cardstock and then I cut her out on the Julie Nutting uh, skin and hair tone uh, paper and then paper pieced the individual elements of this dress. I love how sturdy she is. I mean, she just stands upright on her own and she's giving quite a bit of attitude. Don't you agree? The second project that I created is this large tag. Here I'm using my Audrey doll and I did use the Audrey doll stamp as well as the die. I just had so much fun creating this. At the top here, I've got some really pretty glitter pool. I've uh, mounted this on a a piece of very thick embossed pink cardstock and this background red paper with the hearts is of course from the vintage Valentine's Day paper collection where it says my heart is full these are wood veneer and I went over it with my uh, Spectrum Noir glitter pen and I included several little flowers with pearl trims uh, these were all purchased at Michael's and I also punched out these really pretty red heart foil uh, embellishment. Here Audrey has her cute little hat uh, cut out. I added some pearl trim uh, for her necklace. I even included the pearl trim here on her shoes and then I highlighted her hair as well as the trim of her dress with a spectrum glitter pen. Uh, here on the bottom I've layered a number of different hearts. There's a red uh, heart doily in the back. There's a pink heart with fringe detail and a uh, glitter red sparkly heart. Uh, on top of it, I've layered this cutout that says love and included my signature little Shih Tzu. I have a Shih Tzu named Chauncey. And I thought he was so cute and a perfect compliment to Audrey. Well, this concludes my project review of my Julie Nutting doll stamp collaboration for February. I encourage you to look at the other links in the description. There are a number of wonderful crafty ladies who are participating in this challenge. And as I mentioned, every single month there will be a new theme and a new prompt word. So please join me next month for my next Julie Nutting collaboration. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye for now.